Howdy folks, I'm Eric Williams and welcome to CapeCast, the official webcast of the Cape Cod Times. Today I'm coming to you from a giant rock in Falmouth. Where am I? How did this all happen? Next! CapeCast! Howdy folks, I'm Eric Williams and welcome to CapeCast, the official webcast of the Cape Cod Times. Today we're in Falmouth to explore B.B. Woods. I packed my car at Highfield Hall in Falmouth. That's where this begins. According to the website of the 300 Committee, a private nonprofit land trust organization in Falmouth, B.B. Woods consists of 383 acres of land given to the town of Falmouth by Mr. and Mrs. Josiah K. Lilly III in 1966. Although the woods show no evidence of colonial dwellings, we can tell by the relative youth of the trees and by the stone walls that it provided lumber, firewood, and pasture land to Native Americans and early colonists. In 1966, the land was slated for a 500-home development when J.K. Lilly purchased it for future conservation. And oh boy, now B.B. Woods hosts an extensive network of walking trails that cover miles of varied terrain, exploring wooded ridges and steep-sided hollows, and encircle the picturesque pond known as the Punch Bowl. <laughs> Nature Sound Department. Something's making strange noises. looks pretty small right now, but that's a big rock! Big! What have we learned today? B.B. Woods is big, full of stuff, lots of rocks, big rocks, a cool pond. Too much for one afternoon, but it was fun. Gotta go. Hate to leave you up on the rock, but I'll come back. Cape Cast.